briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1964, the Supreme Court of the United States heard Calhoun v. Harvey, a case that centered on the rights of union members to nominate and vote for candidates in union elections. The lawsuit was initiated by three union members who claimed that certain provisions of their union's bylaws and national constitution violated the Labor Management Reporting and Disclosure Act of 1959, restricting their ability to participate in nominations and elections. The district court dismissed the case, citing a lack of power to protect the members' rights, but this decision was overturned by the Court of Appeals. The Supreme Court case raised questions about the Secretary of Labor and federal court's power to protect employees' rights under the Act, with the respondents requesting that the union be prevented from conducting any elections until fair and reasonable eligibility requirements were implemented. In the end, the Supreme Court overturned the Court of Appeals' decision and upheld the District Court's decision, explaining that Title IV violations don't affect jurisdiction under Section 102 of Title I of the Act. It maintained that the union's bylaws didn't violate the right to nominate equally, and thus the District Court lacked jurisdiction to take further action. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for Visit lse.law Elevate your mind Leave the stress of class